welcome to Silver Sneakers. I'm Melissa and I have a 15 minute workout for you today, one of several that I'm hosting. And today's 15 minute focus is for strength. So I have several exercises for you. We're going to start with a warm up first. But I'd like for you to have a chair somewhere handy right near you and maybe a small towel in case you feel a little sweaty and some water to hydrate. Alright, so we're going to get started with our warm up. If you need to pause to go get those items, just put me on pause and come right back. We'll get started with our warm up. Good to see you all. Let's go. Alright, so we're going to start with just a squat. Keep it as shallow as you like, okay? Just squatting. Making sure our knees track it over the second and third toes. Trying to keep our shoulders above the hips. Again, these can be small. You can speed it up or make it as slow as you need to. All right. As you get warmer, maybe you're going to get a little deeper here. All right. So the next one is a dynamic bicep and tricep stretch. So palms forward, standing nice and tall. Just going to reach those arms up over the head and reach right in between those shoulder blades. Okay, big reaches. The arms go as far as you can behind the body. Keep it nice, straight arms. And last one. All right, so the next one is a standing YTW stretch. So you're gonna come Hands forward on the body, and then out into a Y. Forward, and then out to our sides. Forward, and then into a W. Forward, back to the Y. In, T, and W. All right, let's do that one more time. Y, T, and W. All right. Ooh, that should feel nice. Okay, so the next one is a standing wide leg squat. Okay, so it's just shallow. We're going kind of wide here, waking up those inner thighs. Does that feel nice? Knees tracking over second and third toes, shoulders above the hips. All right, we're going to add a little to that. We're just going to do a little. Torso rotation as we come up. Down, up and rotate. Down, up and rotate. Again, keep it as shallow or as deep as you like, okay? This is just a warm up here. All right, so our next one is the standing hamstring curl. We're just gonna pull those shoulders back and kind of kick our butts here. Pulling those shoulder blades back. Whew. Making sure that chair is out of the way. Whew. All right. Oh, that should feel nice, right? Get a little bounce in there, a little squat if you choose to. Squeezing those shoulder blades in towards the spine. Whew. All right. So our next one is a standing. We're going to do an arm raise here and a tip to the side. Switch, tip to the other side. Switch. Nice deep side bend. Long arms. Feel yourself getting taller every time you reach those arms up to the sky. Ooh, and don't forget to breathe. All right. I'm just gonna walk that out, maybe jog in place here. Everybody feeling good? Good, ready for the workout? Okay. So we're going to start with body weight in and out squats, okay? We're going to do three sets at about 20 seconds each. So you're just going to squat to the side, to the center, and then the other side. Again, you go as deep or as shallow as you want to, okay? Speed it up and go faster if you like. Okay, move number two is a rear lunge. So you're just going to step back and do a knee thrust. 
and a knee thrust. My toes are facing forward of my body. Add a little balance challenge here. I'm trying to keep my shoulders above my hips. All right, and then we'll switch sides. So the other leg goes back. Add a knee thrust here. Again, this is up to you how deep you go. Maybe it's shallow, maybe it's a little faster, okay? We're getting a little balance challenge. And strength. Heart rate's going a little bit there also, right? Yes. Okay, so this is a strength workout here. So I'm gonna have you do wall push-ups. I have my wall is over here. I don't know if you'll be able to see me. So you're gonna pretend you're on the wall here. And then you just push your body in and back out. In and back out. You can also do this just standing, doing a chest press to just really contract the chest. No weights at all and no wall. Pull hard, push hard. Just squeezing the chest and pulling. And pulling. Whew. Okay. So the next one is an opposite arm leg reach. Okay, so your right leg's going back, your left arm's coming up. And then you do the opposite side. It's a little balance going on. We're just alternating here. I'm going to show you the side view. And back. It's almost like a scissor run. Again, you can modify this however you like. But this is a strength workout, so we're going slow and controlled. I should be feeling the back of my leg contracted there. Working those hamstrings. Yeah, doesn't that feel nice? The abs are tight. All right, the next move here is your hamstring curls. So we're just gonna pull and kick the back thigh. Okay, butt kickers with a nice pull here. Whew. We're not just working on our legs here, we're actually working on our hamstrings also, right? The back of our legs. Squeezing those shoulder blades in towards the spine.
seconds, so a good time to grab a little water. Make sure that chair's out in your way if you're not using it. Always feel free to sit down if you do want to use it. We've got about five more seconds. Hope you're all feeling good. So we're going to start with those in and out squats, all right? So you're going to squat to the side, back in. Other side, back in. Squat down. You can go faster if you choose to. Just really squeeze those glutes and focus on the back side doing the work here, all right? Still making sure the knees are tracking over second and third toes. Go deeper if you're comfortable. You prefer? Use your chair. Push up. Control as you go down. Just coming up and down out of your chair. That's another option there. Second move. It's a power lunge with that knee lift. So step back, knee lift, down, knee lift. Working on strength, getting stronger. Always adding in a little balance challenge here as well, all right? Whew. You take a break at any time you need it, all right? Otherwise, I'm going to keep going. Give you a little break in between the sets. Find one leg's not as strong, or not as uh, stable as the other one. Right. Ooh, we got about five more seconds. Again, speed it up if you want. Toe tap it back if you choose to, if that leg's getting a little too tired. And we're done with that one. All right. Shake it out. Now, you're onto your wall push-ups. I feel like you can see me from here. I can see this wall right here, right? You all see me? We're going to head into some wall push-ups, all right? So abs lock in. The further you go back, the more challenging it is. All right. You can stay up high if you like. We've got about 15 more seconds here. That other option I showed you was just focusing on a chest press. Pretend like you're pulling something back, pushing something forward, okay? That's the other option other than those wall push-ups. And we're done with those. Yes. Whew. Now we have our opposite arm and leg reach. So your chair is always here too if you need it. Or you're going to go um, opposite leg goes back as the arm is going forward, okay? But you're alternating. So maybe you want to do this behind your chair in case you need a little help there every once in a while, all right? Should feel the back of the hamstring firing just a bit. Get a nice workout there. The core is working to balance. You could always make the move a little bit smaller. There we go. And one more. Woo. How y'all feeling? Feel good? Energized? Yes. Okay, we got a few more here. We're gonna head into our hamstring curls. So give a nice pull, squeezing those shoulder blades in towards the spine. Kick in the back side. Yes. You can slow it down. Pause for a moment there. Really fill in those hamstrings. Woo! Yeah, yeah. Oh, just a few more. Good. And squeeze back there. Woo! Is that heel reaching those hamstrings? That's what we're aiming for. All right, get that chair handy again. We have our seated bicycle curls, or again, you can do a standing, okay? I'm going to show you the standing version again. It's basically just a knee tuck here. Bicycle. Here's the chair option. Good squeeze. I'm focusing more on my core than the leg lift, okay? Core is doing the movement for me. Control in that core. Good squeeze. Hold in that pose. It's like you're hollowing out your belly. Pushing that spine back there every time you do this crunch. Three more seconds. And last one. There we go. So now we are doing a squat to a heel raise. There's your squat. Heel raise. Squat. These could be as slow as you like. Again, this is for strength, right? Ooh, go at your own pace. Have fun with it. Feel those calves burn. Just focus 
and on the glutes doing work. Maybe you really want to go a lot slower. Try to get a little shaky there. Lift up slowly with control and hold. Yes. One more. Yes. Okay, now we're into that side lunge with the knee pull. So coming out to the side. Hold. Again. And hold. So for some, it might be here. Bring the foot in. Just a little bit of balance challenge there, okay? If you're in it, try to go in as deep as you can here. And then we'll hold. And hold. Other side. Power it out of this heel as we come up. Power out of that one, right? And hold. Again. Woo! Oh, you got about four more seconds. And last one. Oh, yeah. That felt nice. Woo! All right. So that concludes our workout for today. I encourage you to as many of these videos from me as you like as long as it's okay with your doctor and you're good with that combine any of them or just do one maybe two three times or even just once is good it's all up to you have a wonderful day and i hope to see you again thanks